In this channel, we have a tradition where I suit up for the season finale, but still no pants. And you know why? Because this is a hobby, not a job. Let's begin. I think we left off at a bunch of these monsters spawning. And look pretty dangerous, but I mean, look, look at our team, man. This is stacked. Those bears are still adorable, though. Like, pain alone is just so stacked. So is me. So is Maple. Like, there's no actual threat or danger, right? We'll see. I don't know if these characters are going to survive. You know, I hope they do. It would be pretty sick, but... Yeah, I'm more worried about them, man. The brothers and the green-haired guy. Where is he? There he is. <laughs> ah, I can't believe I... Do they ever explain his name? I don't... I, I actually don't know his name. I've been just calling him a hoo-ha because he reminds me of the guy from uh, Black Clover. Okay. These are a little bit bigger looking dudes. And it's pink, not blue. Oh. Surely we can beat that, right? The big final battle, guy. Let's go the finale. It's another fake maple. Is this supposed to have some kind of Cthulhu-like design? Right? I don't know. Something about the mouth and it's like um, deep sea creatures. Oh, wait. They can summon meteors? I think that big boy just summons some meteors. Ah, it's fine. It's fine. Maple got that invincibility skill. Exactly. So if we took... Aegis? Was... Was it ever called Aegis? I, I thought it was called Heavenly Sacrifice or something. Uh, that's also cool. But if we just stay here and use that spell, wouldn't that work technically? Okay. Of all the monsters so far, this one definitely does look the most intimidating. <laughs> Rest in peace, other characters. These poor players. They tried their hardest. No! Their medals! Someone gonna stop the stomp. Oh! A green attack? From who? Syrup. Maple tree! And if we do this, their reputation as a guild will improve so much more. It's like, oh my god, Maple Tree is out there saving them. Or the fact that Maple Tree is fighting the big bad monster at the end. Everybody in the world chat's probably typing right now. There we go. Godzilla versus Godzilla. But we're looking a little tiny. Can we use like the spell that makes us bigger? Or just multiple Godzillas? Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is what we did at the end of season one, remember? <laughs> Wait! I can't really tell. Was that the Ginyu? Ginyu Team 4? Uh, Ginyu Force fo pose from uh, Dragon Ball? They kind of posed there, but it was a bit too dark. I can't tell. Maple's voice in this Godzilla form is still disturbing, man. Man, look how tiny we are even compared to this. We're like little ants compared to this big boy. Hmm? Main Yui double strike? Okay, okay, let's go, Kuromu. <laughs> They're just gonna keep smacking in one place. I mean, that's gonna, probably gonna work if you have a weak spot. Kazumi! So everybody's like focusing on specific like weak points. Oh! Good one. Actually, yeah, if we just copy more made, you we can just do more big bonks. And then Maple's still just eating it everywhere, so it's just like doesn't know where to focus. It's actually on its knees. But how are you gonna get a killing blow though? No, oh, Kuromo really? Kuromo really defending against that? Maybe I'm really underestimating Kuromo's defensive capabilities. He is the other tank after all. Wait, did that monster just literally leave? He was like, fuck this, I'm out. Wait, it's really running away? What's Maple up to? That's Machine God. What kind of machine gun? Okay, just direct fire onto the wing. Smart, smart, smart. You know, we're doing pretty good considering I thought every guild would be attacking at the same time. It's still only Maple Tree. This landing's a little bit difficult. Could you imagine if they just died from the fall damage? <laughs> like, Sally might, but no, no, she's fine, she's fine. That's a direct attack. Maple? Maple? Heavenly sacrifice, please? Loving sacrifice, something? Oh, we haven't used that in a long time.
No, we'll be fine. I think. I'm more worried about Sally. Surprised she didn't take any damage there. Because she's a glass cannon. Okay. Back up, back up. I feel like their quest to help the other players out was intentionally put in there so that we don't defeat the monster too quick. Right? Because, like, if we went in immediately, all three guilds, like, it'd be too easy. They wanted to have an excuse to let Maple Tree take it on first. Man, Misery's design still is like, Jesus Christ, there's so much bad service. Wait, isn't this the opening theme song? You know what it means when an opening theme song is playing during the finale of an episode, right? You know what it means. It means it's like the heroic triumphant moment where everything's gonna go good. Bonk! Oh, I think that was right on the monster's toe. Could you imagine? Dude, getting your toe stubs hurts already enough. Could you imagine if me and Yui bonked yours? Oh, the gravity attack? I want some kind of really cool, like, trio combination move to finish it off as- No fucking way! Not different what?! No shot! He's gonna get the moves in too?! Like, unironically, I think he's one of my favorite characters! <laughs> even though I don't even know his name! Yo, even the brothers are getting their attacks in. This is actually so good. They tried their best. They tried their best, okay? Hmm. I think we're gonna get a guild master combo right now. Yeah? Everybody's just gonna do a beam attack together? Maybe? Maple, shoot it! Oh, even Sally's getting it in come. Okay, I'm like, wait, Sally doesn't really have beam attacks, but she's still got one in. Yo, you know what I just realized? Why don't we just use Devour on it? No, it, it would be too cheap, right? There's no way Devour would just work that easily. Oh, no, not Zero! That's actually a bitch slap. No, that'll be good. That'll be good. That'll be good. Maple's HP is that low? I guess she's been taking a lot of damn. Damn. Of all people, Maple's HP is that low? But because it's Maple, I think that amount of HP with her like defense capabilities is more HP than most people at full bars here. Oh, Sally. Sally? What are you doing? To rescue Maple, maybe? Oh! The elixir. Easy. <laughs> full HP? Salute, Sally. Hey, what's she planning to do? Tentacle attack, maybe? Everybody's counting on them! What's she gonna do? Hmm? What? I, what? Do, do what? Shoot? Make Maple go into... Man, that's what I said! Just use Devour! No way it actually works though, right? Like, it, wouldn't it be too cheap? Did that actually kill it? No way. Even Sally still catches Maple at the end. No shot! I jokingly said, what if Devour works? It actually fucking worked! It's fitting that Maple gets the killing blow. Woo! And this means that the joke character survived also. I'm so happy. Dude, his Rosa attack? This guy's Rosa attack? Even the brothers? Oh my... Granted, it didn't really do anything, but they still got an attack in, you know? Go! Oh, it's so big today. Now, what's the reward though? It should be big. Any skill or equipment. <laughs> Look at him. <laughs> I love him, dude. He's... How did he become one of my favorite characters in this show? Like, it's crazy.
Yeah, you guys tried your best. Code Alpha. They even had a cool name, Code Alpha. Not enough. Oh, wait. She's right. You know what? I never thought about it from that perspective. Because they've been trying their best at all costs. Yeah. She's been so strict, but like, she's right right now. You guys should be kind of proud of yourself. They're, they're all smiling. Where did this motivation speech come from? So, oh, her glasses came off. You know, she came into the season two as like the newbie dev that was kind of like bossy. But in this moment, this is like a leader. And she, she's spitting. She's spitting some facts. <laughs> okay, thank God we're getting overtime pay. Oh, yo, the devs are getting paid. Even the devs are getting a dub this episode. Let's go. Let's go. Yeah, you guys are getting really excited. Yeah, like, can you probably... She's making a lot of promises, but <laughs> empty promises, maybe? I guess we're not going to find out the reward until season three. Oh, that kind of sucks. What? Just go around the village. <laughs> Just gonna hang out. <laughs> Sally even came to the graveyard together for Maple. This is a nice way to exit the season, though. Just like Sally and Maple hanging out. Like, they. This is how, like, season one started, right? They just wanted to hang out and go to different places together in this video game. And then it just kind of evolved into this crazy show where Maple just gets crazy powers and defeats all these different monsters together. And we formed a guild together. Oh, remember that? When Maple was so slow, Sally had to carry her. Damn. This does bring back a lot of memories. Even stronger monsters and guilds. That would be pretty cool if we had different guilds that like rose up and could challenge, you know, the Flame Emperor's Maple Tree. You know, Holy Order. Oh, who are these characters? Oh, new characters I've been... Season 3 territory? Aww. We got some challengers! Oh, shit! You, you can't hype me up for season 3 right now when it's not even announced! Aww. But that's good, though. This is good. That there actually is potential for season 3. Who is this? Probably the new kill that's gonna come, like, you know, rise up to the challenge. Yo, this is getting more interesting now. Really? Hmm, we'll see about that. And there you have it. That's season two of Bofri. I hope you guys enjoyed watching it with me. Season three territory. It seems like there's a little bit of, you know, hints that it's going to continue. I don't know when the announcement's going to be, but we'll see it. We'll watch it when it comes out. But hey, if you're still here, if you enjoyed this reaction, please like the video and check out the other playlists for even more content. And until next time, take care.